Very important skill. I think communication skills, both oral and written, but let's stay with the oral communication skills. Can, if you have good oral communication skills, can actually get you very far. But let me be clear what I mean by good oral communication skill. It's not reading a speech. A lot of people can do that. It's not looking at a teleprompter and just reading. Many people can do that too. The issue is when you read it, how do you make the words go into somebody's emotion as opposed to somebody's ears? How do you uh, deliver the speech so people know it's your speech as opposed to you reading somebody else's speech? And more importantly, when you speak without a speech in front of you, Lila, the person who's listening to you should be able to form a picture in their head of what you're talking about. So even the most complex subjects, break it down to its component pieces and deliver it so that people can form a picture in their minds right away. And that's a skill that's teachable, that's trainable, that's practicable, if you want to call it that. But I think that we have to equip people with that capability because as you become a leader, as you ascend, you have to constantly mobilize your troops to come along with you. And you can't always pick up a piece of paper and read from it. And you can't always just repeat what you're saying and expect to get the same result if it hasn't gotten the result so far. So at every point in time, you have to tune the speech to the audience. You have to create vivid pictures in their mind and constantly let these pictures evolve so it goes from the mind, from the head to the heart. And that's the skill that, you know, uh, we all have to teach people. And it comes with watching great speakers. You know, one of the greatest speakers I've ever heard was Vernon Jordan. Vernon Jordan, when he spoke, knew which line to emphasize a second or a third time. And he knew which part of the audience to look at and emphasize a line. He knew when to slow down, when to pick up. He, he I mean, he had the gift of speaking. And, you know, we should encourage people to listen to Vernon Jordan's speeches. Bill Clinton is another great speaker who can take a simple subject, make it too complex and then simplify it again, but it'll create a picture in your head. So if you look at some of these great speakers and listen to them, I think we can all get better at this particular skill, critical skill to move ahead.